So this is the Progressive Dynamics converter. Uh, it's a 45 amp converter that I pulled out because it wasn't working and it was getting no power out of it, uh, which means it wasn't powering anything else. So when I pulled it out, I heard something rattling and it turned out to be this piece right here. This was actually loose and rattling around inside. So I decided to pop the rivets, which were here and here and a couple on the front and go inside and see what was going on and it was an obvious place that it belonged right there. Um, I did call Progressive Dynamics Service Department and they confirmed that it was a high wattage resistor. So I took a chance and soldered it back on and just put some silicone on either side of it to help stabilize it and I'm just waiting for that to cure so that I can put everything back together. I did get some sheet metal screws, uh, number eights, drilled those pilot holes a little bit bigger and they fit perfectly so I'll be able to get in and out of it if I want to. So that was apparently the whole reason that the converter wasn't working in the first place. It wasn't getting any, getting any juice. So when I soldered that back on and did a little bench test, it was definitely putting out 13.5 uh, volts and it ran for two hours. It did get real hot. Uh, but the service department guy said that it will get hot. Um, that's kind of its job. So learned how to get into the converter, troubleshoot it, and uh, luckily was able to fix it.